Ram and Tina are attending their first chemistry class together. Ram forgot to carry his stationery. Seeing this, Tina immediately gives her pen to Ram. This creates a very good bond between them and now they are best friends. This reminds me of the ionic bond between different compounds. Puzzled? Let me explain. Consider sodium and chlorine atoms as Tina and Ram. Ram was not carrying a pen and would not have been able to take notes. On the other hand, Tina had an extra pen which was currently of no use to her, so she gave her pen to Ram. Similarly, the sodium atom has one electron in the outermost shell making it unstable. And chlorine is in desperate need of an electron to complete its octet. Tina gave the extra pen to Ram and both were happy. Likewise, sodium gave its electron to chlorine and both became stable. Sodium, due to loss of an electron, becomes positively charged and chlorine, due to the gain of an electron, becomes negatively charged. You must be wondering that now both the atoms are stable, but where is the bond? We know that opposites attract. So, a positively charged sodium ion gets attracted to the negatively charged chloride ion. This is called electrostatic force of attraction. This force of attraction between the oppositely charged ions formed by a give and take of electrons is called an ionic bond or electrovalent bond. This bond ultimately results in the formation of a molecule of sodium chloride. Like Ram and Tina, you all should continue with your chemistry class too. See you next time.